Greetings, salutations, YouTube. It's Adrian here. Welcome to another edition of Goodwill Hunting, where we go to various Goodwills and see what treasures we can find. I'm super excited to take you guys into the store with me today because I haven't gone thrifting in a week. So, I have to get my thrifting fix right now. Let's go inside, check it out. But if you guys love thrifting, you love thrift hauls, you love vlogs, so don't forget to subscribe. Hit the little bell button for notifications, and don't forget to add me on Instagram. It's Adrian, just like it's spelled here. And check out my shop at itsadrian.com to see what I have for sale from my thrifting adventures. But without further ado, let's get into that store and see what we can find but cross your fingers for me and hopefully we can find some treasures today oh my gosh how cute is this kitchen $50 cute look at these handbags I think I saw this last time this looks like a Brighton but the natural fibers they don't do too well with age juicy couture Is that Stone Mountain? Now I don't think in this store they like connect the bags anymore to like the wire things at the end of the fixtures because I don't see any more over there. So maybe they just mix everything together. Maybe they're behind the register. I just noticed that right now. find the exciting oh this Michael Kors has been here forever but the handles are atrocious on it is it B. Mikowski? it's a huge B. Mikowski if it is and it is a B. Mikowski how much are you B. Mikowski $7.99 Hot dog. It's a little dirty. We'll check this out though in a second. See what else we can find. There's this little juicy bag down here, but it is just falling apart. Susan. Michael Stevens. This BCBG bag. I like the color of that bag, but it's just pleather. This is another B. Mikowski, I think. Yeah, it is. You can see it on the hardware. Come on, B. Mikowski. I don't know how much you are. Cute, though. There's this cute Kelsey Dagger bag. But... This strap right here is going undone. I don't know if it's repairable. Let's look at the state of the rest of the bag before we make any final decisions. It's actually kind of cute, so I think I'm just gonna hold on to it for now. See what else we can find. Union Bay. This is another Brighton. Yeah, it is. An older style for sure. Capizio. Stone Co. Nine West. Oh, I do like the style of this. This is like a moss mouth from Target. I like the style of this one too. Victoria's Secret. Oh, it's the Bina bag. Street level, I thought it was a Cleo Bella for a second. Sabina bags are pretty cool, but this is just like. I don't know if it's torn, like, I know this is just like the interior of the handle. How is the rest of the bag itself? The rest of the bag is actually pretty cool. I wonder if I could just fix that. The interior is a little dirty. 
$7.99. Guess we can think about this. Because I do like the rest of the bag. It's like very. Uh, no, the piping's coming out. Okay. I think I might pass on that. Piping's always a little difficult. Oh, well, that's actually not too bad, but. I don't know. What do you guys think on this bag? It's kind of cute. I'm just going to hold it for a little bit. Let's see what else is here. This is like almost a Brighton. I wonder if this is like Forever 21 or something. And it is... Oh, attention. Don't know that one. Alright. I think that's it for the handbags. Let's go check out the rest of the store. I was looking at these fake hydrangeas, but whoops, not my favorite. I am looking though too at this very nice looking pitcher, 9.99 BTP, made in California, USA. This is really nice. What do you guys think about this? I think it's really cool. You know how I like that blue and white motif. I'm gonna hold on to it for now and decide, but I don't think I see any cracks. Oh my gosh! His beak is missing, but he looks like Buckbeak from Harry Potter. I kinda want him, but he's broken. Alright, now I'm just looking through the vases. This wooden one is kind of cool. That's from Target. Uh, it's like, I think it's missing a glass piece. I saw this and it catch I like caught my eye. I really like the pattern of it. $9.99. It's really heavy. And the glass is really clear. But I'm really looking for blue and white vases. That is kind of my prerogative. Oh, they have like a bunch of elephants down there. This horse. This horse is cute, $1.99. Someone left their soda. Oh, a bunny rabbit. How cute. Grace, you wear from home. Look at this cool artichoke thing. Oh, it's broken right there though. $4.99. It's super heavy. Some fake pumpkins. That cat cookie jar. Ooh. Oh, look at this blue and white box. I do like this. It's pretty cute from TJ Maxx. It went on sale a lot. $4.99. All right, you guys, now we are looking for anthropology plates. Oh, Mikasa. Oh, these are actually really cute. Oh, it's broken, but it has all sorts of vegetables and stuff on it, which is adorable. Oh, these are cute. Poland. I think these are Pottery Barn. Yes. Pottery Barn. I don't know why two of them are connected and the other one isn't. These are the ones that I saw last time, I think. There's like a bunch of them. Sausalito, $5.99. See, I hate when they put cracked ones together. And then it's like, why am I going to buy all of those? When some of them are cracked, like I don't want the cracked ones. Right? Like, look at these. There's another cracked one. That doesn't make me very excited. 
Ooh, threshold, $2.99. Those are really nice. I like the scrolling pattern on the sides. Ikea. This is nice. Made in Italy. I love like that design right there. Okay, what else do we have? Cisco wear. Ooh, those are really heavy. Oh, these are very anthropology, yes. Castleton, China, Malin, and Ching Chi Yi. Made in USA. How pretty is that pattern? It's like to die for. Ooh, Lennox. Love that. Leaves. I'm like literally so like on the hunt for something that's anthropology. Like I'm working hard on this. Ooh, is this time for Jeff? No, it's not. Oh, how cute is this? Oh, Pottery Barn? Ice cream, yeast cream. We all scream for ice cream. $1.99. How many of these plates are there? Let's see. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's a third one. I wish they would have put this in the set. That would have been really cool. Instead, they're two dollars each. This one's five ninety nine. This one's somewhere else. One ninety nine. You guys, Eliza would die for this, but why is it twenty dollars? I know these things are expensive, though. These are like from Target. It's probably originally like forty or fifty bucks. But how cute is that? He loves trains. What is this mug? Victoria Engraving Collection, I love it. So cute. Oh my gosh, a pottery bar mug. Eat your veggies, a C is not average. Is that homework finished? <gasps> Why is this so my mom? And it's pottery bar and hot mama? I need this for mom. Oh my gosh, I totally remember these. I, I think they sold these at Nordstrom, they're so cute. But this, like, the print's coming off, so. I'm gonna leave it. These are cute, like, these little western things. Vegas. I'm just making sure I'm not missing any anthropology mugs or Starbucks mugs or anything. And if I am, please tell me. Oh, William Sonoma. Oh, an R. Oh my gosh, an R for Rainer. That's my dad's name. I have a feeling that I think the color came off of it, but it still kind of looks a little cool. Dishwasher and microwave safe, made in China. And it's orange. Orange is the color of the day, so that's half off, so I'm going to get this. Um, don't touch my coffee. Room essentials, that's Target. Best day ever. Alright, you guys, we're doing well with the mugs today. Excited. I just found this huge cabbage plate, but it's so damaged. I think I can't get it. Oh, these are so cute. Made in Taiwan. Oh, look at this. I love the color. Oh, this is cute too. Why do I want everything? This is that Mikasa thing. Oh, this is so stinking cute. How nice is that? Oh, Sir Top. I think I saw this last time, but it's broken. This is pretty nice too. It's not Pyrex, but it's, I think it's like the, I forget what the brand is, but it's the one with the anchor. When it rains, it pours. How cute are these? Now this is like the wooden tchotchke section. 
see if there's anything exciting here. Oh, bird houses. Did I tell you guys that there's a bird building a nest in the rafters of one of the pergolas? The one like in the courtyard. It's so cute. But it is pulling off some of the fringe on my pillows to build the nest. But I'm like, how could I not let it? It's going to build a home for its babies. So, <laughs> I'm just like, whatever, just take it. Just take the string. Alright, let's check out these toys and see if there's anything we can get the kids. Not that they have enough toys already, but I don't know. I just like to buy them some toys sometimes. If there's anything really cool. I'm also looking for like little toys, little car toys for, um, I have a little, I don't, little nephew, he's my nephew, in the Philippines. I'm already going to send him a bunch of like Eliza's extra stuff, but I want to find some cool like cars, toys for him, like from the movie, like something like this, but not missing all the cars. Yeah, that's like kind of the goal. Oh, spider, I hate spiders. Oh, the furniture section. I feel like this store hasn't had like big furniture pieces recently. This is where I got my dining table from, from the store, the Pottery Barn dining table that we re, like redone. And it has like that quartzite top on it now. Oh, how cute are these outdoor chairs though? How much are they? They're $30 each. Honestly, it's not that bad, but they're cute. Huh. But I don't need those. I actually want like a little outdoor bistro set for uh, mom and dad's patio. This is actually kind of cute to be honest, but it's like damaged or bowing or something. $7.99 is not bad. It's really heavy. Oh, this chair is pretty nice too. All right, I'm going through the shoes really quick, seeing if there's anything exciting. Oh, you know what I totally forgot? That today is a Target and Hunter, like, collab, it's like, premiere event or whatever. That today's the day it's coming out at Target. I think I have to call my mom and tell her because she wanted to go and get some boots. Ooh, they have some Stuart Weissman. Cute. Marona. Found this Nanette Lepore top. I like the print. Let's see what else we can find in the clothes. Oh my gosh, the decor is on sale. Lemonade. Fresh. Oh, fresh lemonade. How cute. All right, you guys, I just left the store. I got some really great stuff, so don't forget to subscribe. Hit the little bell button for notifications, and tune in tomorrow for the haul video. I love you guys so, so much. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you guys did, please give it a big thumbs up. I'll see you guys in... Oh, don't forget to check out today's vlog. It goes up at 2 p.m. Pacific time. I hope you guys so much. See you guys then. It is a long track, but it's what we're trying